Hi, today we are going to show you how to set the time and date for most of our audio recorders and even some of our cameras. Now, depending on the device, the actual amount of folders that you're going to see when the device opens up on your computer might be different. You might also have one that's called video and one that might be called pictures as well if your device is capable of that. If you are seeing something else other than the set you this time, it's okay. Many times the name of the file itself might be different. However, it will always have the word time on it, and that is what you're looking for. So, in order to get this, you got to make sure that the device is actually in the off position, otherwise it's not going to open up this window. Once you're ready to set the time and date, all you do is just double click on the folder to open it, and then double click on the actual application to set the time and date. So, I'm going to do that right now. When I do it, I actually get a notification that my time and date has been successfully stored into the device. This time and date that you see here corresponds to the correct time and date that my current computer is running. So if the time and date in my computer is accurate, that is what your recorder is going to use from here forward. What does this do? It's going to allow you to make your recordings like you normally do. However, your recordings will not have the correct time and date for when they were recorded. That time and date will appear in this field over here. Now, if you, like me, have recordings in the device that happened prior to you setting the time and date, those time and dates for those recordings will not be affected by this particular um, application of the time and date stamp. Anything from here forward will run based on the time and date stamp, and you do not have to do this every day. The device itself will keep track of the correct time and date. The only time that you might have to redo this step is if there is a change in the time, such as with daylight savings time. Otherwise, you are set to go, and uh, you can go ahead and make your new recordings, and they will have the correct time and date. I hope this little tutorial was helpful to you, and if you still have questions, be sure to reach out. The phone number is 845-371-0000. The website is www.spysite dot com or you can always reach us on the chat via the web so uh let us know if this is helpful and if not reach back out thank you